Hi friends, Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to Surmi World. I hope you all are good. So today we are going to make a Arabian sweet dish. This name is kunafa. And I am sure that you all will love this dish. So yeah, let's go to the recipe. Before that, you didn't subscribe my channel. Please subscribe, click the bell icon, like, then all you will get the notification of my videos. And don't forget to like and share to your friends and families. And don't forget to comment my videos. So yeah, let's go to the recipe. For that, I'm taking here kunafa dough. If you don't have kunafa dough, you can take vermicelli. And I'm going to put this dough into a big tray. If you want to grind in blender, you can grind in blender, but don't grind more. I think so, it will take a little bit of time to tear this into a small pieces. So yeah, let's wait. And guys, my mom is helping me to tear this dough. And yeah, let's tear it. Now we tear all the dough. So like that we should do. Okay. Then yeah, let's go to the second step. Now we are going to cut the butter. I'm taking here less, little bit butter. If you want more butter, you can take more. So I'm taking here six tablespoon of butter. So yeah, let's put into a plate or any bowl, something else. So I put into a bowl this butter. Now we want to melt the butter. So I'm going to melt the butter. So for that, um, we have to mix with a spoon so that will help you to melt our butter very really fast so our melted butter is ready here so let's put into a bowl or anything else now let's pour this melted butter into our dough After that mix with your hand, very 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 nicely mix with your hand. Now we mix it very well. Now let's press our dough. And divide into two parts. So like this we have to do. Now take a bowl or anything else and put one cup of milk into that. And two teaspoon of corn flour, I mean cornstarch. Then mix well with a spoon or anything else. Now I'm going to put 2 tablespoons of fresh cream. After that mix well. Now I'm going to take a cheese. It is very thick. And I'm going to put some of that. If you want more you can put more. And mix it well till that melt in milk. Until it be thickest that much time we have to mix with a spoon. So our batter is ready here. Very thick and very cool. This consistency we need. So yeah, let's go to the next step. Now we want to make a sugar syrup. So for that I am taking here half cup of sugar and half cup of water. If you want more, you can take more. So let's use into this our lemon. I am taking here half piece of lemon now yeah let's mix up so yeah it started to boil so our sugar syrup is ready here so only this much this is very easy to make now we take here a pan and putting some butter into that and spreading all of the sides so now I spread it very well now let's put our dough into that this is the first step of kunafa first part of dough we put here so yeah let's press it gently with our hands now 
we press it very well. Now we can put our batter into this which we make with fresh cream and cheese and milk. So pour into this very very gently. This is very nice to see guys. So this is a kunafa inside filling cream. So this is very easy to make kunafa you must try guys. So middle of the dough we have to spread our cream very gently. So we spread here very well. Now let's put some cheese into this to get a good feel and very tasty. So yeah let's add our cheese into this. I am taking here some cheese if you want more cheese you can take more cheese. So our second layer is ready. Now let's go to third layer. So for that I am taking here our second part of dough. So yeah, let's add into this. Very carefully you have to do this okay. So almost we put all our dough into this. So now let's press gently with our hand. Don't press harder. Be careful. So we press here very good and nicely. So now let's go to the cooking. Now we are on the stove. Now let's put our pan into our stove. Then cook 10 minutes in low flame. Be careful you must put in low flame okay. Now 10 minutes are left. Now let's see how our kunafa one side is ready or not. So for that I am flipping with a plate. Oh my god this be very brownish and nice to see. Now I am taking a pan to cook another side so I am putting some butter and spreading through all the pan. Now let's put our another side of kunafa into pan and cook 10 minutes in low flame. Before how we cook like that only we have to cook now. So yeah let's wait for 10 minutes. Now 10 minutes are left. Now let's flip our kunafa how it be let's see oh my god this also be very brownish and very good guys nice to see and this will be very tasty and yummy so yeah our kunafa is ready here for decoration i am putting some pista which i crushed in blender so yeah here our kunafa is ready now let's cut with a knife how the inside is looking good or bad let's see Guys, this is very crispy when I cutting with a knife. You can see, yeah. And this is very tasty, guys. I'm not saying like I'm, this is very tasty. You must try this. And let's see the inside. Oh my god, the cream are very perfectly came. And I like this kunafa. You must try it. Those who are seeing my channel first, please subscribe. Click the bell icon. Then only you will get the notification of my videos. And like and share to your friends and families. So don't forget to comment my videos. So okay bye bye. See you on another recipe. Assalamu alaikum.